Hello everyone, I'm Tomb Raider Crony and I'm playing a custom level right now that was made with uh, the level editor that came with the uh, Chronicles game back in 2000 uh, when the fifth, fifth game was released um, and I thought these phases were shootable but yeah alright, uh, uh, let's see where I can go now the builder of this game is Afzalmia, and this is this is um, the debut level of the builder, which means this is uh, the builder's first level, and it's it's uh, already looks very very good. And we're in the classic atmosphere of the catacombs in Tomb Raider 4. It reminds me of that atmosphere. Very nice, I love those light rays by the way. Um, yeah, and I wonder what the. Yeah, uh, the switch opened this door. And I'm going to save because um, this is a blind gameplay I'm doing right now. So I have no idea what's uh, coming. Up, um, another door. Where's the switch? For this door, I wonder, is there anything there? Uh huh, a hidden crawl, s crawl space. I've almost missed it. Alright, um, another switch over here, and I guess this is what opens the door. Then, <sighs> no, this is another door which I have no idea where, where it is. Probably somewhere here. Yeah, this is another push button switch okay oh darkness and I don't want to ma waste all the all the flares so I want to use another one now I'll just quickly drop down and go forward and alright you have right to a new area and it looks really nice there's some yeah, a couple of closed doors and also, oh no, I hate mummies. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Uh, oh my god, four of them. Are you kidding me? I hate mummies. Oh crap. Oh my god, okay, so yeah. Um, I got to find these all these switches fastly why are they colored I'm wondering I'll just use all of them uh, don't cough in my face at least they are slow but when I was playing in Tomb Raider 4 uh, these guys scared the crap out of me This is a receptacle for a puzzle piece we have to collect, I guess. And I'll save immediately. At least this is a calm place. I hope they can't follow me here. Alright. Uh, oh, shotgun shell. And I've read that there are there will be some skeletons also later in the game they are somewhat better than mummies because uh, at least uh, skeletons can be killed but mummies don't I, I'm not sure if uh, explosive ammo can kill uh, the mummies but I haven't tried it yet to be honest close door again I'll see if there there's something in the water. Yeah, a couple of passages. This is a smaller one. I'll go here first. Ah, here's the shotgun. Alright, let's see. I, I I think there should be a switch that opens the door upwards. Somewhere here. 
Yeah, uh, another passage. Okay, let's see. The yeah, texturing is really nice in here. In the levels so far. Okay, another lever switch. Yeah, and I can hear the door opening. And let's just find a way. Alright. Oh, those faces are creepy. <laughs> Over there. Okay. Um. Ah, here's the puzzle piece. Oh, it was green before. Um, yeah, it's basically blue. <laughs> All right, probably the orangish lighting, which is really nice. I love this room. All right, now let's return to the creepy mummies. Oh, I mean, panic already. But at least I have a shotgun now. Uh. I hate them. But what I basically don't like about them is that they are oh invulnerable, and this is a wraith or what whatever. Yeah, wraith, a ghost-like thing. I'll need to yeah find the object that destroys them. You have to get close to these um, statues. That kill these ghosts. Oh, come on. It just keeps hurting Laura, and yeah. I've read in the read me that there's something like return to the previous passage if uh, the wraith, wraith um, doesn't die. It should be a bug or something. And yeah, oh, oh, oops. And I'm wondering if uh, if I can do that without hurting Laura too much. All right, now I'll just wait for the for the wraith to go off. Oh come on! Oh finally! All right. Thought it would require more time. I was afraid about that. Is there anything in here? Uh, I think I yeah. I've seen a ladder. Well, I think it is. Yeah. It's a climbable wall. What is here? Yeah. Another platform. Oh, oh, oh crap. Yeah. Here's the skeleton. Alright, I'll just save first because I'll try to oops um force it off the Oh come on. Come over here so I can shoot you off. Alright. If you don't wanna wait there or something Yay, alright. And it's dead. Hooray! Alright. Hmm. The only way to kill them is to um, push them off a ledge into uh, the deep or explosive ammo, which I don't have yet, so... But luckily, the builder provided a shotgun. So, yeah, that was really helpful. Oops. Yeah, here's the um, passage that got opened, I think. Yeah, here's the next room. Oh, wow. And another skelly. I read in the readme that it cannot... Um, follow you up the stairs so I'll just go this way 
And what are those strange things in the center of the room? They look really interesting, to be honest. <laughs> I have no idea what they are. Okay, what does this do? Oops. Let's not leave a big medipack in here. What did the button switch do? And the other question, how can I kill the skeleton? Oh, do we have to live with that guy running around in here? We don't want to. <laughs> Whoops! It scared me from behind. Ah, oh, crap, get off! Is there anything? Oh no, there's nothing under the vases. Vases? Not sure about it. Oops, correct pronunciation. What did that switch do? Oh, all right. Here's a ladder, a climbable wall. At least skeletons can't climb. You just have fun down there. Alright. Hey. Is it a tiny Oh, alright. Here's another switch, so... Yeah, I won't panic for now. Ooh, okay. I was worrying that it was a tiny and I missed the door opening, but... And here's a... What is this? spiky thing called Pharos Pillar. Okay. But where does it go? I haven't seen any um, puzzle receptacles where you could place it. But here's the... Uh -huh, the crossbow. Which will come in handy. I hope there are some explosive ammo included yeah Scully here I come where are you just come over here I'll finish you off All right uh, yeah now he's hiding no oh. not really All right bam that's what you get for scaring me a couple of times. Alright, what do I do now? I'm not sure where to place the forest pillar that I just got. So, yeah. Um. I'm also not sure what these are for, but. Well, they are interesting. Oh, level design. Some Egyptian mystery, perhaps. Oh, I haven't noticed this passage over here. I tend to overlook things like these. Oh, it's dark in here. Alright, I'll save. Just to be safe. Just to be here on the safe side. Uh, I don't like darkness. Alright. Light a flare. Yeah. Um. Is this a. Uh, does this trigger anything or this fa face is just here? Well, maybe uh, this is a push block puzzle, but. Yeah. Here's the. Pushable. And I guess that uh, face. Um, floor texture is where I have to um, push this one so that door next to me opens on the right Oop. oh there was some ammo under it I've just noticed and Corridors and the rooms are getting darker and darker. <laughs> I 
I like the reddish light on the floor. And also this orangish light. Okay, just two more squares. One. And the final one. And open sesame. Done. Alright. I'll just pick these up first. Don't want to leave any ammunition ammunition back. I've also read in the readme that there are some stronger enemies that like uh, demigods, so I better be careful. I'll just yeah. Oops a crocodile. Two crocodiles. I don't like them. I really don't like underwater enemies. They can't even come up here so I could shoot them, but uh, oh well. I'll just be careful. Oh, come on. What do I have to do here? There's a giant face in the wall, but. Oh, yeah, there's a hole in the ceiling. Oh, did I just come from here. Oh no. Yeah, here's a uh, push button switch again. So, ooh, let me just find a way back and pray that these crocodiles won't taste me. Alright. At least that room was big, so I don't have to try and Woo! Oh my god! Try and avo avoiding those crocodiles from. Oops! Yeah, here's what I was talking about, and the health bar is flickering again. Oops! These are. Uh, come on! Oh my god, I'm out of shotgun ammo. Alright, I'll try to jump around and avoid these, um, whatever are they are, these bombs. Hope there, there's no, no other demigod enemy over here. Alright. Is there anything hidden under these? Nothing. <laughs> and can this be... Shot, yeah. And here are some flares we can pick up. Oh, well, there's nothing under this one, on the other hand. Okay. Raised floor is always a hint. <coughs> Next to high clums. And bar textures on the ceiling so you can climb it. And use this, use it as monkey balls. I'll go for the ammunition first. Oh, not ammuni ammunition. Some. Yeah, I could see some pickup, but wasn't sure what it was. Is there anything over there? Can't really see. But let's go and see if there are some ceiling thingies leading into here. There should be something. Yeah, I can see. Uh, pick up what? What is it? What the? What the hell is it? Um. Um. All right. Yeah. Oops, um, and now I really have completely no idea where to place these. I'm just picking up objects and... Oh, I hope I don't have to go over that crocodile um, 
pool again. At least one of them is stuck. Yeah, I could see another passage, but I've already been in here. And I've already used the um, switch. So, yeah, the, here's a, another passage which I haven't noticed before. But the door is closed. Okay. I'll go and see if... Yeah, there are two passages to switches on both, both sides. I didn't know that. But I have no idea w in which one I had been already and which one not, but I guess it was this one. Alright, let's try again and see if the door got opened or not. Yeah, it's open. And another creepy room. And another puzzle piece. And I think, yeah, I can combine this one with the Ornit handle. And I have a portal guardian. Uh, okay, now, where do I use these? Okay, I just try and swim back. And yeah, I guess there's nothing else in here. Yeah, both of them are stuck. Which is an advantage, since I don't have to worry about them anymore. Yeah. And these are the times when I like um, bugs and glitches in games. Right now, what do I do? What do I do? Oh, there's something over there. I think these are the yeah the Uzis. Oh, okay. And I've checked if if it was secret, but I couldn't hear the audio but the um game got laggy a bit and i could see the ceiling <laughs> previously what was it oh well <gasps> oops and oh another of these demigods or what or not i thought these mummies were were those Oh well, we're the responsible for for the weird sounds. I'm trying to find out now where where these um, pickups go, which I collected. Why is that door closed? Aha! Uh -huh. All right, I figured it out. Here's where the virus pillar goes. Goes. Um, Where does the other one go? Oh, oh crap. Yeah, this is why I hate mummies. Oh, come on, Laura, place it. Okay. Oh. Oops. They sound really creepy. And the new room, and... Is that blood? I hope not. But the eff effect is cool. It looks dangerous. And what does the switch do? I don't really dare to jump into this. But uh, oh, I'll, I'll try anyway. All right, it's not deadly. Okay, let's see if there's anything else in here. Yeah, here's what, what the switch did. Passage down here got opened. Alright, and what's in here? Except the... oops, I pressed the wrong button. 
But yeah, at least F1, in the F1 button here doesn't change the resolution. Only write some coordinates and the room you're in, which is good, only good for level building. And oh, and that means the cheats are activated, <laughs> but I won't use them. The you can use the dozy cheat. Whoops. Oh crap. Didn't want Lara to. Uh, yeah, I wanted her to turn. Oops, I thought. thought she would die. Alright. I just ran out of ammo. Oh crap, come on. Yeah, I have to jump sideways so. And sometimes it's still. Uh, it still hits lower. Great, yeah, oh my god, here's another one. Yeah, you cannot have two active um, demigods, two or more active demigods in level, by the way. It's some mysterious um, TRLA thing, level editor thing. And uh, one one uh, enemy get remains frozen until uh, the other one dies, and then it activates. Here's how it works. I no idea why uh, they did it like that, but at least you don't have to fight two of them at the same time. Okay, but what do I do now? Is there anything hidden in here? No, nothing. Oh, maybe. At the... yeah. Vase or... sculpture or what, what that was. Okay, anything else? Can't see anything to be honest. Yeah, there's a. What is that? I use the binoculars. I barely use these, by the way. I'm just going around and stuff like that. I think I'll need the crowbar to get that one, and I don't think I have it yet. And yeah, it should be somewhere here, I think. But I cannot really see um, any new places I could go to. Where's the crowbar? Hmm, I'll just go back. Things are happening fast, and I might have missed a couple of things and happenings. Where did I come from? Oh, of course. Alright, I hope I didn't leave it here. But then, still if I did, I would know where it is. But, but this way I have no idea. But I haven't seen that button switch before. What does it do? Oops, and I can hear the mummies through the wall. And the door got open, but... I have, I'm completely clueless where it is, where it might be. Oh, where did I come from? I think I ca came from there. And I have to go somewhere here after I get that star thing from the wall. So first I have to find a crowbar, but where is it? There's something. These are some arrows. I was hoping that the crowbar would be here. Where's the crowbar? But 
don't want to go back to the mummies, but I have to. I got to see if I missed something. Whoops! I hate these guys. Oh my god! Anything? Nothing. And nothing. Ah! Get off! Hello everyone, I'm back here in the area where I started off and I got a tip from the builder where I actually should go and um, yeah previously I pretty much uh, got lost and I think I'll cut that part out because it's really um, yeah boring pretty much because I'm just running around in previous areas and ooh and uh, basically I completely forgot forgotten about the explosive uh, ammo and um, I didn't count on that the um, mummies leave you a sword which can be used as a crowbar um, so yeah um, I got this uh, tip from the builder so now I can go on and continue playing thank you Okay, now let's hope I remember right about the location about the oh, of the previous room where I have to use this um, sword so I can yeah so I can pry pry uh, I hope that's uh, the correct word so I can uh, get that um, star out of the wall and I've also got a small information that I'm close to the end of the level now so let's see what happens in here after getting this um, star from the wall alright and the last jump yeah here we go and let's use the sword Right, and now I have the star, and I can proceed further. I think I remember th where the, the two mummies were, which I killed. There was a um, receptacle or something for this um, star, if I remember right. But I'm not sure, I don't trust myself anymore. And... Also, here's this closed door. Oh yeah, here is here's the um, receptacle for the for the star. And now the door opens, and let's see what we can find here. A closed door. Yeah, I think here's where I got confused. Uh, there was this um, switch over here that opened the door somewhere. Oh. Uh, yeah. I'm stuck again. This door should have opened a door that looked exactly like this one over here. Oh yeah, here's a. Oh, I haven't seen this passage over here. We have to use all of them. No, oh, this one can't be used. Used, and this one can. Yeah, and this one can't be used either. Okay, yeah. Whoops, and here's a passage also. Uh, oh, it's the place where I come from. Yeah, that was the place where I come from. And here's the new, new passage, and I'll save it then. And I wonder, wonder what's coming up now. Yeah, here's uh, another puzzle piece. Which I have no idea about what it what it's called. So, yeah, forest not. These were used in the um, somewhere in the Alexandria levels in Tomb Raider 4, I think. In the um, Cleopatra's palaces and yeah, somewhere somewhere there. And these 
houses are shootable, I think, yeah, but there's nothing under them. So I'll just use this puzzle piece. And yay, door got opened. And I'll save again. Because I like it. Uh, I think this is the final room. Because here's a red game. And um, here are these beautiful light effects. I think, uh, and yeah, the music um, suggests that this is the end of the level. So I think I'll just grab this one and see what happens. Yeah, a door opens, uh, which leads you to the light. And while I'm going to the Oops, um, to, towards the end of this level. Yeah, how nice it feels, yeah, yeah, right. Um, okay, so this was the end of this, um, really great adventure. It was, uh, pretty short, but, um, I really enjoyed it. And sometimes I really ap appreciate uh, shorter levels because uh, they don't take your, you don't have to take your time that much to, um, uh, finish them and, um, yeah, they are nice um, little adventures, um, especially considering that this one was a, a debut level. I think it was uh, really, really great. The builder did a great job. Congratulations! And uh, it was a really, really successful um, debut level, uh, in my opinion. There weren't much. Uh, I didn't notice any beginner mistakes, to be honest. So, uh, really nice work. Um, keep building. Keep your levels coming, and also thank you for watching this um, let's play uh, Cat Films at, at Dusk. Bye.